Hi, this is Joel McDonald with 2020 PPC. And today I want to talk about a special way to use the content network that most people don't really get into. Just so you know, uh, I'm going to be showing you screenshots, and all of the numbers are real. They cover a one week period, they're, they're from an account I manage, but because of confidentiality reasons, I have changed keyword and, and any specific details just to protect uh, the confidentiality of, of that client. So, basically here we are, we're at the ad group level. Notice that we're at the ad group tab over here in an AdWords account. And as you can see, I've changed the ad group names in the campaign so as not to give any details away. But in a nutshell, we've got a client who is willing to spend as much as 70, or well, 50 to $100 uh, per conversion on various keywords that we're managing in their account. And uh, they're a pretty high volume client. And one of the most common things people do is everybody knows that you can adjust bids and say that in this case we're, we're assuming this is a client managing investments and they do precious metals. So let's just say that they've got this gold account that they're willing to spend as much as $70 to get a lead because they make $250 to $300 per lead, uh, you know, that that's what they're willing to do. And everybody knows that you can adjust bids based on what the cost per conversion is. So in this case, we might raise those bids a little bit. We'd raise those ones a lot because, you know, we want to get more aggressive and get more placement in the content network so we can get more leads and more sales and, of course, more revenue. Um, everybody knows that you can do that. And how you do that is you adjust the uh, your display network bids. And if you're running managed placements, you would adjust your managed placements bid. Now that in itself is a little more advanced, but you can take it even a step further. And the way you do that is by drilling down into the networks category. And notice that we already do have some managed placements in our account. And in fact, they're generating the majority of our sales. And they're generating it for slightly cheaper per conversion. But here's the interesting thing. Notice that we're being a lot more aggressive by a margin of about 50%. So we're bidding, on average, 50% more per click. Actually, we're bidding a lot more than that. But we're paying 50% more per visitor in the managed placements but it's cheaper to get those conversions. And that's because of the power of managed placements. Now, if you're not familiar with managed placements, this will all be a zero. You know, everything in here will just show as a zero because you're just bidding and letting Google determine uh, what websites you should advertise on in the content network, and you're doing entirely automatic placements. But what you want to do is drill down further. So what you want to do is click on this show details page or sh this show details link which by the way is under automatic placements. If you're not doing management managed placements you would click on the show details in automatic placements. And you'll look, see a screen that looks a lot like this. And, it, and Google will tell you, you know, typically you can sort by number of conversions or cost per conversion but what you'll see is, you know, let's just say that I was bidding on one or two keywords. What you'll find is those keywords perform entirely differently depending on what website. Now, obviously, this isn't a gold account, but you get the idea. No matter what industry you're in, if you are tracking conversions, you will be able to drill down within your accounts by clicking on that Networks tab and then clicking on this automatic placements link and you'll see what websites are driving traffic for you and getting conversions. Now remember my clients in this case are willing to spend fifty to a hundred dollars per conversion but look at these little golden nuggets that we're picking up for a buck, two bucks, eight dollars per conversion, thirty nine cents we picked up a, a lead for 39 cents and they're willing to spend 50 or 100 dollars for that lead. 
So what you want to do is take more control and make sure that you're showing up as often as possible for those various websites. And the way that you do that is you check all of the websites that have had conversions at an affordable cost for you and you'll find that there are tons of them and you check each one that hasn't been added to your managed uh, networks campaign and you simply check the box and then what you want to do is go right up here to this manage placement and bid button here it is I circled it for you in another screenshot so you simply click on that and they'll give you a little pop-up that pops up right above your regular screen and tells you what you were bidding for that keyword and since you know that this has been this keyword has demonstrated that it has converted for you you want to go ahead and get a little bit more aggressive now I typically use round numbers here um, just for simplicity sake but you know in this case I was bidding three dollars per click for a certain keyword on this website in Europe now I'm gonna go ahead and raise it to four because I'm I wanna start tracking how that individual website is performing for me and since it's already indicated that it is performing well and giving me actual conversions not just traffic but actual conversions I'm gonna start getting more aggressive and I'm gonna do that for all of those keywords notice I was bidding three bucks now I'm bidding four I was bidding a buck seventy now I'm gonna bid three I was bidding five now I'm gonna be bid six now notice that it's it's round numbers and that's okay because what we're doing is we're getting more aggressive to make sure that those websites show your ads more often and then you're gonna go back and fine-tune at a later date once you start to get a lot more traffic and make sure that it's converting affordably for you so after you've done that you've you've entered all the bids that you want to do based on your ad group and the website that is uh, delivering that traffic and then you hit save and then with time you'll see that more and more of your traffic will come from managed placements and not from automatic placements and your goal here is to get the majority of your traffic coming from managed placements and the more traffic you get going with the, the sites that you actually want the traffic from the more conservative you can start to get and the more money you can begin to save on those random websites that Google starts to deliver for you which are not converting so the goal here is to get as much traffic from the controlled websites that you know are converting well I mean really which would you prefer to have a bunch of random traffic that Google is deciding what's best for you or as much traffic as feasibly possible from this website that's costing less than 50 percent of what uh, you're willing to spend on a per lead basis so the goal is to get as much traffic as possible and eventually you'll get back to a screen that looks something like this except instead of having 60 percent of your traffic coming from managed placements with time you'll start to get less and less random traffic from automatic placements you'll actually lower those bids to even less than this is and you'll what you'll find is you you're able to get a lot more aggressive and get a lot more qualified traffic from your managed placements so in a perfect world this would eventually represent 90 95 percent of your traffic and this automatic placements can either be entirely shut down after you've found all of the websites delivering good qualified traffic for you or dialed way back so that you can continue to explore and let Google help you find new websites but that way you're in the driver's seat not Google and you're in control of exactly what you're spending and you'll know that you're getting as much traffic as possible and again just one more note about how much more powerful this is I can get 50 percent more aggressive with what, what I'm spending per visitor to my website but the conversion rate is almost double so notice how powerful that is imagine if you could find all of the websites that are converting for you only bid on them and get almost double the conversion rate as what Google was finding for you on their own that's the power of thinking of the content network in a 3D fashion, not just a 2D fashion. I hope this video was helpful. 
If you have other questions, feel free to chime in on my blog at 2020ppc.com.